It is also a matter of deep concern that here in this province we have recently witnessed acts of violence directed against foreign nationals. That is also a great, is a matter of great concern. Because <clears throat> our constitution talks to intolerance. Constitution preaches tolerance. It preaches living together which is precisely what the chairperson of our province was stressing here. But the attack on foreign nationals, for whatever reason, is a form of intolerance that the people of this country have rejected many times before and must do so again and again and again. Because as South Africans, we are not an intolerant people. And we cannot be defined as being intolerant. We cannot be defined as not wanting to live side by side with people from other nations. And these recent attacks that have been leveled against people from other countries are wrong. They violate everything that our people fought for over many decades. And as for me, I condemn them in the strongest terms because this is not us. We continue to appreciate what our fellow Africans have done for our liberation because they stood side by side with us as we were engaged in struggle. They supported us willingly in a comradely manner and some of them were as far afield as countries like Uganda, countries that were not even our neighbors. They supported us because they felt that racism and apartheid was an abomination against humanity. And they joined the struggle, gave us refuge, embraced us, and supported our struggle in more ways than you can imagine militarily, resource-wise, and gave our people a number of skills and so forth. We shall never forget the sacrifices that they made, and we shall forever be in the debt of many African countries on our continent. There are a great many foreign nationals in our country who are here legally, who respect our laws and respect our people. If there are foreign nationals who act outside the law, yes, they like South Africans who do not respect our law should know that they will be dealt with in terms of our constitution, in terms of the precepts that are laid out in our laws. And they should know that they will be dealt with by the law enforcement agencies and not by people who just roam about and take action against them. There is no reason and no excuse for anyone to take the law into their own hands. The attacks on foreign nationals, whatever reason they are for, begin to manifest themselves as xenophobia against foreign nationals. Xenophobia has no place in our new democracy and we must do everything to root it out. Remember to subscribe and ring the notification icon so